what is webhook how it work and we'll try to see a live demo hello everyone welcome back to talented developer in today's video we are diving deep into the world of web development to explore a powerful tool known as webhooks so exactly what is webhook in simple term i can say a webhook is a way for one system to send real time data to another system as soon as an event occur so what is here event occur let's try to understand with example now imagine a student data application is there and which is going to hold all the student data of entire city or state and that application will run on localhost 8080 port so now what will be happen how many school is nearby in their city they will try to sign up into all data student application so how they can sign up they can use here localhost 8080 slash demo slash add new school using this one ronaldo school hero school Kohli school, Batman school, all other school can easily sign up. Now imagine Ronaldo school is already sign up and after that Ronaldo school student will try to sign up into all student data. So what will be happen? The student need to call one API and that API will be like localhost 8080 slash demo slash add student using this api any student of ronaldo school they can easily sign up in all student data application after that what will be happen once the student data is sign up now ronaldo school need to know like how many new student is sign up into all student data application on that time all student data application will provide one api and this api you can see here the api will be look like localhost 8080 slash demo slash get new student using this api always ronaldo school try to find how many student is newly added into all student data application so using the same approach all the different school will also try to find like whether any student of their school is sign up into all data application or not so using this approach now ronaldo school will call get new student api and they will try to find whether any student is sign up or not so they will keep calling maybe they will try to call in next one minute or maybe within one minute they will try to call five times so sometime they will get the data sometime they will not get the data but maximum chance is like they will not get the data and they will keep calling get new student api so using that one what will be happen they can get irritate so similar thing it can also face by all student data application because they can receive multiple requests from so many school like is there any new student added or not or maximum probability like they will send just blank data so definitely all student data need to find a proper solution so they can reduce the api call and they can easily satisfy to their client so here webhook going to play an important role so now let's understand how webhook will work and it can solve this problem so now what will be happen all student data application will try to implement a new api demo add webhook event so using this one now a school need to provide some data data in the sense like all student data application will say like some event name event name need to provided by all student data application so here all student data will say to all the school like if you want to know like whenever any student is added you want the data then what you can do just give me your in point url like where i can send all the student data to you and just send me event name as add so what will be happen now ronaldo school will try to send the data so if you notice here ronaldo school will have their own server and that server will be run at localhost 9000 so now what will be happen ronaldo school will call add webhook event api and they can pass this kind of sample data here event name will be add and in the in point url you can see this in point url this in point url will be like whatever client having the api where they want to get immediately response so now how the flow will be like ronaldo school student will try to now sign up they will call add a student api into all student data application so now once the request will come to all student data application they will try to find like whether ronaldo school having any webhook event or not so if they found like okay they have already one event name that is called add now what will be happen all student data application will send that student data directly to localhost 9000 add new student so whenever any student of ronaldo school will try to sign up on that time the add event will be triggered and they will directly send immediate response to localhost 9000 slash add new student so similarly now student data can provide some different event like event name delete event name update so now what will be happen if 
Ronaldo public school student will try to delete the data. On that time, Ronaldo school will provide some different kind of API. So immediately that student response will go to that API. Similarly, so many school now they can set their event for the ad and they can provide their specific URL. So now whenever any student will come, they will immediately get the data. So now no school need to call all a student data application API always. So they can easily sleep because they knows they have already set one webhook event. So whenever any student will be added, they will immediately get the response. So using that one, all a student data application also problem solved because they will not get so many unwanted requests. And now a school can also relax because they will immediately get the data whenever the student will try to sign up. So you have so many example like digital messenger that delay information instantaneously and you can take another example like github so you can set your webhook in point url so whenever any code push will be happen you will get immediately notification so webhook are widely used to automate process synchronize data and create seamless integration between different applications so now let's move to demo so currently I'm going to show the demo into a Spring Boot application. I have already created two specific video like how you can create a webhook from the scratch, one for the Java and one for the Node. If you want to understand, please go and check it. So now you can see here Ronaldo school having their application and they have created one API. So I can say this is the endpoint URL where they want response from all student data application. And this application is running at port number 9000. So whenever any student will be sign up into main application, main application means like a student data application. On that time, they need to send the webhook response to that application. So here, whenever any student will be sign up of Ronaldo school, they need to send immediately response to that specific API using the webhook. So let's try to understand using the postman i'm not going to explore any code please check my earlier video so this is one in point url you can see here localhost 8080 demo add new school here ronaldo school is trying to register once they will sign up you can see they got her id as a one now what will be happen they will try to set the webhook in point so you can see here they need to pass their school id school id is one and in the body they need to pass the event name as here add and in point you can see localhost 9000 webhook student added this is here you can see localhost 9000 then webhook slash student data now what will be happen they will try to update their webhook event into main application so they will get response like webhook added so now one student will try to sign up from ronaldo school so you can see they are putting her id as a one this id means here school id and you can see the student name is here Ria Kumari RTYY and age is 6 year. So now they will try to sign up on the main application like a student data application. You can see we got message here student added. So now what will be happen if you go to Ronaldo school application and here you can see we are getting one notification here like a student name Ria Kumari. And if you are getting response here that means the webhook is sent by the main application main application means here a student data application so you can see here they also got messenger webhook received this webhook received means like they are getting from the this application you can see here so here ronaldo school is working properly so whenever any student will try to sign up of ronaldo school into a student data application they will immediately get the webhook data so this is a simple demo you can please check my earlier video i have explained in much more depth and there you have it a basic understanding of webhook and a practical example of how they can implement it webhook are powerful tool in web development if you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more content thanks for watching happy coding bye